Are you serious? Are you serious? Last night, guys, yesterday, yesterday, we had tornadoes tearing through Oklahoma and Wisconsin. Two people are dead. Dozens are injured after uh, 26 tornadoes tore through different places on these two states, including a mobile home park in Wisconsin and a subdivision in Oklahoma. There were 26 reports of tornadoes yesterday, according to the National Weather Service, as a massive severe storm system tore through an area from the South Plains of Texas to the Great Lakes. Matter of fact, none of the tornado reports have yet been confirmed by the National Weather Service, but man, there's a ton of destroyed homes and things, so you know they were tornadoes. Barron County Sheriff Chris Fitzgerald confirmed one person died and at least 25 people were injured after tornadoes, possible tornadoes left behind a severe damage between uh, a couple different towns in Wisconsin and uh, also a trailer park at Prairie Lakes Estate. Uh, it's a mess out here, and we've got, uh, uh, we, I've been looking at some of the pictures here, it's just a disaster. At least two dozen of the 50 people or so in, of trailers were destroyed, okay? Um, and then in Elk City, Oklahoma, damaging possible tornadoes hit numerous homes and structures. The roofs were tore off of structures, homes collapsed, multiple people reported trapped inside of homes in Elk City. And uh, uh, another person was found dead. So we've had two people killed, dozens of people injured, homes, trailers, different things destroyed. All of this happening yesterday between Oklahoma and Wisconsin. We're going to keep a close eye on all of these things as extreme weathers continue to break out across the world. And especially the United States seems to be being hit with everything. And uh, including a 4.1 earthquake this morning at only 2.3 kilometers deep on the coast of California. So there's a lot going on. Keep, keep praying and pray for the families of these folks that died and also pray for uh, the injured and the, and the destruction and devastation that's hit these communities. I'll be back with more current world events and how they relate to biblical prophecy. Don't miss today's live broadcast. Starts at 12 noon Eastern at my website at www.paulbigleyprophecy.com.